bisectored. What the triangle angle bisector theorem stated was when we have an angle bisector, right? This line bisects that angle. What that now states is two proportions. So now we can say that these, this kind of broke it up into two different triangles, right? Well, it broke it up into two triangles that we could say are now proportionate to each other, where I can now say that 26 is to 12 as m is to 8. So now they are proportionate on your side. So an angle bisector creates two different tri triangles that are going to be proportionate to each other. OK, Malik? This is your homework and your problem. Right? So now I just need to simply solve this. So I do 26 times 8 and 12 times 5. 26 times 8 equals 12 times m. So now I just go and take my handy dandy calculator and do 26 uh, times 8. Divide by 12 on both sides. And I get 17 and 1 third. OK. That's it. Malik.